Hey Virgo, Rising Storm here. So I'm about to do your journal of reading for the month of May. Keep in mind that these are general readings. Take a prize. Feel free to switch the storylines however you would like, all right? So I'm going to be looking to your overall view. <coughs> Excuse me. Your energy is Virgo, the person that you're dealing with, right? <coughs> Why is it all happening? And the possible outcome for now until the ending of May. What is going on with Virgo and the person that Virgo is dealing with here? Can you show me? What's up? So the overall view here, Virgo, what is this? The Wheel of Fortune in reverse. The world, the Empress. Why is it all happening? The Ten of Swords. You may be dealing with the Libra or Taurus. It doesn't have to be. I got fire sign, water. Something seems to be a bit stuck. Why the world? We'll see what's going on. Why the world and why the Wheel of Fortune in reverse? Why the Wheel in reverse here for the overall? So something seems to be a bit stuck, stagnant, not moving. Ooh, you guys are arguing. Somebody here could have had some sort of conflict, or there could have been some sort of conflict here in regards to something not moving forward. Uh, the Wheel of Fortune in reverse to the Five of Wands. So it's kind of like something is stuck. There's something that's not moving forward here between the two of you, and there could be some sort of drama uh, with the five of wands or some sort of argument or fight. Uh, show me the world. So Virgo, you have the world card. What is this world about? Show me the world card. Clarify the world. What is this? The world. Two of pentacles. You're closing out a cycle and you're letting something go. So I think you're closing out a cycle with this person, Virgo, and it's like you're dropping them here. Okay, so there's a situation here where it's like, you know what, you're just made some sort of decision to kind of end this connection with this person. Uh, maybe in the past you were going back and forth about ending this, but now it's telling me you're kind of just dropping this whole situation with the world card and the two of pentacles here. You can be the one with the Sagittarius, doesn't have to be. Um, but you also have the Empress here. Show me the Empress. What's the Empress? What's the Empress card? What's the Empress? Show me the Empress, please. Yeah, but you feel burdened by this, man. I do feel like you want to have some sort of growth or you want, you know, you want things to expand and things to move forward, but you feel like this is too much of a burden or, or maybe this is too much stressful for you. The Empress, the, the Ten of Wands, to kind of like, you know, grow this. So I don't know if you were like have to like you put like a lot of work into this connection and you just felt like it was too much and it wasn't going anywhere. Um, I don't know what this is, but it kind of just looks like you are open to having something that's growing, expanding, nurturing, right? But it's too much of a burden or it's weighing too much on your shoulders uh, in regards to this connection with the person that you're dealing with, Virgo. Like it's too much. Um, the person that you're dealing with has the two of wands in reverse. So we'll see let's see what this is about. What's the two of wands in reverse? Show me the two of wands in reverse. Why is that? My cards won't stay still. Why the two of wands in reverse? Clarify the two of wands in reverse. So they're, um... Yeah, they're not making a decision here. They're kind of a bit at a standstill as to what to do. Uh, the, the, it could be done with the Pisces, it doesn't have to be, but they're basically not really making a decision. They're at a standstill right now. Uh, they're not really moving forward. This person's kind of like, you know, thinking, um, contemplating about this whole thing, but not really making a decision to move stuff. So it, they seem to be very stagnant right now, at a standstill, not knowing what to do, not doing anything. Um, why the Six of Cups in reverse? Why the Six of Cups in reverse for? Why the Six of Cups in reverse? I don't know why, but they're they're holding back and they're seeing you in a bad um they're holding you could be doing with the Leo by the way but they're 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 seeing this whole situation as something negative or they're looking at you Virgo as holding a grudge 
they may kind of like be holding a grudge against you or there was something that was said or done in the past that they're unhappy about or they're not seeing you in the best light and it's like they're holding back they're strongly holding something against you here for some reason i don't like that Why is all happening? The Ten of Swords. So this could be like a betrayal, an ending, right? Feeling rock bottom. Why is all this? Why the Ten of Swords? Why the Ten of Swords here? What is this Ten of Swords about? Yeah, Two of Swords. Yeah, because right, right now, I guess this is why it's all happening. Somebody here is being very indecisive, very kind of like closed off, not really making a decision. Well. <laughs> Feeling rock bottom as to what to do, right? Um, Virgo, how are you seeing this person? How is Virgo seeing the person that they're dealing with here? How is Virgo seeing the person that they're dealing with? Can you show me? The Emperor in reverse. <coughs> oh, excuse me. The Emperor in reverse. Could be dealing with an Aries. Why the Emperor in reverse for? Why the Emperor in reverse for? Why the Emperor in reverse? So you see this person as someone who's basically not taking control of the situation. It's like you see this person as someone who's not really coming in, giving you this cup of love, giving you this offer, right? You see them as someone who's just not budging, not taking, you know, control, not really being there. They're not being the emperor that you want them to be. They're not being the person you want them to be. It's like you see this person as someone who's not stepping up to the plate, not really coming in with an offer, really not doing much or not giving much, not putting much on the table, I guess you could say. Um, maybe you see this person as someone who's very much stuck in their in their ways, right? Their, their, old, their patterns, their ways of thinking, whatever the case may be. It's just... Uh, give me the person that Virgo is dealing with. How are they... Uh, How are they seeing Virgo right now? How is this person seeing Virgo at this time? How are they seeing Virgo? Nine of Cups in reverse. Why the Nine of Cups in reverse? Why the Nine of Cups in reverse? They see you as someone who's not happy with them. They see you as someone who's not happy with the with So the Nine of Cups is in reverse. So they see you, Virgo, as someone who's definitely not happy with them, someone who's emotionally unsatisfied. They see you, Virgo, as someone who's not getting what they want out of the situation. Let me clarify this Page of Cups before I put my mouth, my foot in my mouth. <laughs> What's this Page of Cups? What's the Page of Cups here? What's the Page of Cups? I think they see you as someone they know that you want to have a relationship or they know that you want something more so it's like they see you as someone who's not getting their wish in regards to possibly having a relationship or having the, that that ultimate fulfillment right why the page of cups why the page of cups the temperance yeah You know, I think for some of you, they, they see you as someone who, I think they think that you're probably looking for a relationship or looking for something new or looking elsewhere for some of you, okay, the temperance, but it's like they, they know that you're unhappy with the situation. Why am I getting... Why the net? Why the page of cups here? Why the page of cups one more time? Yeah, the ace of cups. It's in the reverse. 
don't know why. I, I'm getting a weird vibe from you. Why? I don't know if this is someone who's doing bad things, but then they tend to kind of like see you in a bad light at the same time. And it's like when they see you, that's like they see you as someone who knows that they know you're like upset. You, you're not getting what you want out of the situation. Um, but at the same time, it's like they see you as the page of cups. like this crap I don't like I don't like this energy for some of you I think I'm just gonna put it out there for some of you they see you as someone who they feel like maybe you should apologize I know I know I know I know but the page of cups is here okay and, and it's not going for everybody but they also see you as someone who um, would like to have a relationship or like to get things going here and they also feel like maybe you're looking elsewhere or there could be someone new. I don't know what this is, but I don't, there's a weird energy here because they're not doing anything, but yet they see you as a Nine of Cups in reverse, a wish on fulfillment, and the Page of Cups here. So for some of you, may they may even see you as someone that they feel like they have to apologize to, but they're holding on to a grudge. Um, Virgo, what are your next actions if not yet already? What are your next actions, if not yet already? What are Virgo's next actions, if not yet already, here? Seven of Pentacles in reverse. So you're tired of waiting. Why the Seven of Pentacles in reverse here? So your next actions is to kind of withdraw from this person completely. Like, you're, you're withdrawing, you're completely withdrawing from them. Uh, it, it's kind of like you don't have time for this or you don't want to deal with this, right? The Seven of Pentacles in reverse. It's like you're done putting the energy and time into it and it's like you're completely withdrawn. So your next actions here is kind of like withdraw from this person not really give your, not really give this person your time or your energy. The person that you're dealing with seems to be a bit funky. Like I don't like their energy here. They seem to be kind of like maybe they put the blame on you or... They do something bad to you, but then expect you to kind of like say sorry to them. Like, I don't like that. Uh, how, what are this person's, give me the person that Virgo is dealing with. What are their next actions towards Virgo, if not yet already? What are their next actions towards Virgo, if not yet already? Tower in reverse. Why the tower in reverse? This person doesn't stand, they, they don't, they don't take responsibility. Why the tower in reverse? Why the tower in reverse? They're avoiding and they're going to be holding back. Okay, this person is going to be avoiding you. They're going to be avoiding you and they're going to be holding back for their next action. So both of you guys, in, in a way, are avoiding one another here. One is tired of investing. The other one is just running away because they um, they don't own up to what they do. Okay, they, they tend to hold back a lot. Um, what are Virgo's intentions when it comes to this person? What are Virgo's intentions here? What are Virgo's intentions? Show me their intentions. The Ace of Swords, why the Ace of Swords? That's clarity, that's truth, that's communication, that's victory. And then you got the Five of Cups. So your intentions is to speak your truth and how you feel about the situation. Like you want to air it out. Like you want to tell this person what it is and how they made you feel. So your intentions is to clear the air and let this person know how, like how you, how they made you feel. All right. So it's kind of like you want to just be like, hey, look, motherfucker, da, 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 and this is how you made me feel. Da, da, da. You know what I mean? Excuse my, my French. <sighs> Try not to curse, but that's what I'm getting though. Um, give me this person's intentions. What are this person's intentions when it comes to Virgo? What are their intentions when it comes to Virgo? What are their intentions when it comes to Virgo? Seven of Wands. Why the Seven of Wands? Why the Seven of Wands? What is going on? Why the Seven of Wands? They're going to push you away. So this person's intentions is to push you away and remain single. Like, they want to be single. They want to be independent. I see them blocking this connection, okay, or they're doing this on purpose. Uh, they don't want to deal with it. <laughs> That's horrible. Um, 
their intentions is to block this off and remain single, remain independent, not deal with anything that has to do with relationships here. What's the possible outcome for this situation? What's the possible outcome here for now until the ending of May? What could possibly go down? Six of Swords in reverse. What could happen? The Fool. What's going on here? Why is all this happening for the outcome, possibly? Why? Why the Six of Swords in reverse? Clarify the Six of Swords in reverse. Why is that there like that? So there's definitely an energy here of coming back around. Why the Fool? Why the Fool card? What is this? Yeah, I see uh, why this Two of Cups, why the Two of Cups here in reverse, why the Two of Cups in reverse. I see a return or a comeback around, yeah. And I think this is to try to heal this connection. I said that your intentions is to block someone and be single, but then you come back around. It just doesn't make sense to me. But things happen, I guess. Look. I, I do feel like somebody's going to be coming back around because they can't move on. And I do see communication happening here and a possible, like, new beginning or possible chance to kind of, like, move things in here with the three wands and the full card. I, I do think that there's going to be some sort of chance to try to heal this connection with this person. Um, so, yeah, I, um, what is this Nine of Swords in reverse? What's the Nine of Swords in reverse about? Yeah, the Ten of Pentacles, like, to get over the stress and to have something serious or something long-term, okay, maybe somebody here could be coming through some sort of realization. <laughs> but I definitely see somebody here coming back around to communicate. I see a possible reconciliation or to try to make amends or peace or taking a, taking, taking a leap of faith to possibly see what can happen in this connection between the two of you but that's what i'm getting here if this resonates please like share subscribe leave a comment down below let me know thank you so much for watching and hopefully i will see you on the next video god bless Bye -bye.